Hello, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachel K. You might know me from my Instagram at Mrs. Rachel Krause, and I'm wearing what my husband calls a chin diaper, which is where you have your mask on and take it down like that. Anyways, we're going to be shopping today in the Dollar Tree. I know there's like Dollar Tree, Dollar Store, Dollar General. I kind of feel like they're all very similar, but we have a really large Dollar Tree here. So I'm going to be walking you guys inside, showing you around. I do have a few things on my list. Um, make sure you guys comment down below what your favorites to get at the Dollar Tree are. I'd love to know and I can do like a follow-up shop with me. Um, but anyways, we're going to head in. Let's go do our Dollar Tree haul. If you like these kinds of videos, go ahead and smash that like button below. Make sure you subscribe before you go today. I'd love to have you as a part of the family and let's head on in. Right when we first walk in, they have what they call their weekly wow. So a dollar for these cute light up headbands. They are flashing headbands. Those are adorable. I don't know why they remind me of like a reindeer, but it's probably because it looks like antlers, but that would be super fun if you guys are doing some kind of Christmassy stuff. They also have light up necklaces down here. And they have these Santa solar stake lights that you could definitely put in your yard very cute. I'm still in the beginning section and they have all of their $1 Christmas greeting cards out here. They have a bunch of really cute ones. Um, we are actually looking for one for Logan to be able to send to his grandma and grandpa. So I wanted to find a really fun one that was kind of little kiddish like maybe this Santa's Express one is super cute and they come with the envelope for a dollar. You like cannot beat that price. This is always where I shop for any kind of greeting cards. This Merry and Bright one is super cute too. It's got like a little 3D puff ball. They're really nice cards. Let's see. Have a holly jolly Christmas full of magic and cheer. That one's pretty cute. I think we'll grab this one. They also have these really fun to go cups. They are called tumblers on the bottom. This one says gnome for the holidays. They come with a little lid that you twist open to close. It has this little like, um, it's like plastic. It looks rubber, but it's plastic and it does not remove, but to keep your hands either um, warm or cool. And they also have a couple of green ones with ornaments. And then these guys with their little trucks on them. That one's so cute. Oh, they also have more down here. This one says, let it snow. They have some cute little glitter stickers here. 33 of them for a dollar. They've also got these guys. We have some ornament hooks, which are things like you don't even think about to look here, but they do have them. Color changing LED taper candle. So just like a faux candle. They have ones with a gold base and then ones with a silver base here. They also have like your DIY ornaments, which I showed you guys in my Target shop with me but they have them here as well for a dollar a piece and a bunch of different sizes and shapes. So these guys are round and huge. And these guys are kind of more shaped like a lantern, which is kind of fun. They've got some bells, some tea light candles that are just in the shape of like poinsettias. They have paint your own ornaments here as well, which I grabbed in the Target um, Dollar Tree section, like their dollar store section, but they have them here too very similar, um, just little like clay ornaments with your paints and paintbrush. We have glitter glue sticks. These guys are gold glitter glue sticks. This one's really cute. You can draw on it yourself. It might be a little less messy than paint. They're just really cute Christmas stickers. Ooh, these are cute too if you have a felt tree which i know is super popular this year especially like montessori style these are little felt um dock decorations that you could easily throw onto a felt tree or a felt stocking We all are definitely wrapping presents. So this is also a great place to come for like your wrapping paper and your bags and stuff like that. They have some cute ones like baby it's cold outside and it's glitter. Um, it's got like this nice like ropey kind of looking um, handles. 
we've got a bunch of cute ones and for a dollar you can't beat it the great part about these bags too is they can totally be reused so if you're just using them in your home um you can reuse them even if you're giving them to people they can reuse them too so it's a lot less to waste this one's super fun to me too yeah They also have a ton of gift tags. These guys are little stickers. You get a hundred of them. Um, these guys are also little stickers, but they come with bows on them. You get eight of them. And then we have like the actual tags that have like, uh, that you can tie them on. We've got wine bottles right here. This one's cute. Lots of ribbon down there as well, gift tissue, and they do have large bows, which are over here. I know I saw them. They're right here. So you get all of these bows. There are eight of them for a dollar and they are multicolored. I asked you guys over on my Instagram what you wanted to see at the Dollar Tree and there were um, actually a couple of you guys that wanted to see like the decorations and stuff. So I wanted to show you these ornaments because how cute for a dollar this little um, gold sparkly church and then it comes with like a little bit of pine on top this little reindeer super cute as well it comes in like this champagne silver and then more champagne down here they've got little bell ornaments like a gold reindeer so whatever you're whatever like you're doing your tree in they have tons of stuff for it these are super cute too with like the buffalo plaid they have it in Peace and Noel. They also have this Merry Christmas one, which is super cute with the hanging sign and the truck and the tree on the back. I think that's adorable. They've got little Santa ornaments. Little snowmen, a cute little decorated door. We've got like a little sled right here with the snowman on it. I love this one. It's like a little present box up there that says Merry Christmas. These are super cute. Cute little double candy cane wrapped with like a bow. Very cute. Okay, this is actually kind of cool. So I used to have ones just like this, obviously. <laughs> Way more crazy expensive. These guys can get so expensive. But they're just these little houses um, that you can like light them up. So do not use electric bulbs. Okay, so these, you just put like a little tea light in them, which you can also find here for a dollar. And you can light them up. These are actually really fun. I might grab one of these for Logan so that he can look up. You can obviously see like the dark windows are where the light would shine through but they have a bunch of them for a dollar and they are not glass. So I'm assuming it would be a lot harder for your kids to break them. I know a lot of you guys are homeschooling or even sending your kids to school. Every state has so many different rules, but um, this would definitely be like one of my first places that I would come if you need some more school supplies. I feel like this was one of the points in the year when I started running out of all of my supplies when I was younger. So they have um, these mechanical pencils. We've got regular pencil, pencils, colored pencils, highlighters, literally anything that you can think of here. They also have little mini notebooks, larger notebooks that are just spiral bound, the composition notebooks. And then right behind me, you'll see a bunch of like kind of in between school stuff and organizational stuff because you've got like sticky notes and your garage sale labels, which obviously those are not happening right now, but we've got compasses, paper clips, and then a more like little kid type stuff. So if you've got kids that are going into kindergarten or first grade or something, this would be a perfect section for them. Um, we've got like some brightly colored pencils, a lot of Dr. Seuss stuff here. These are magnetic whiteboard erasers. So if your kiddo has to have a whiteboard at school, this would just be a great section if you are also homeschooling or even if you're a teacher. For a dollar, you can get 32 of these paper cutouts and save yourself a bunch of work, things like that. Very cool. I love all these flashcards that they have as well. 
alphabet counting, um, phonics. We've got Mickey down here, brain busters. Very cute. They also have like these Moana hand lettering. We've got the Eric Carl numbers how to ready to read and it's like the peanuts so just fun things that kids are gonna look at and be like oh I love that I want to try I know there's a lot of you guys out there who love cleaning like I do well especially like when I get in the mood this would be a great place to come you can have um you can have yeah you could have all of this <laughs> but you can find a bunch of different like scrub brushes here just for a dollar a piece like these typically run a lot more expensive at like target or something like that and they're basically the same especially since after a while if these scrub brushes like if you use them constantly like with your dishes like we do you gotta replace them after a while um they also have the ones that you can fill with soap here and like you press the button and it releases some soap onto your dishes and then they have the refills as well We've got a duster. We have some microfiber cleaning towels. So I mentioned those e-cloths that I really, really like, and I do really like them. I've never tried these ones, but if you are just wanting to try out a microfiber cloth, this would be a great place to do it. You get two, a set of two for a dollar. We've got Brillo pads, reusable wipes by Scrub Buddies. So I'm kind of assuming these are more like the, um, what would those be called? Like by Mr. Clean, like the, scrub erase bars if you know what i'm talking about please leave it in the comments because my pregnancy brain is getting to me but i'm assuming that's what this is like but just like a longer sheet of them they also have a ton of like reusable dish gloves here too as a kid this is like seriously bringing back so many memories because as a kid my mom would bring us to the dollar store and she'd be like you can pick out one candy <laughs> they have two full aisle well it's a full aisle but two full sides of candy at ours. I told you this is a huge Dollar Tree, but I am definitely picking up some candy because I have been craving sour candy. They have all kinds of these trolley or trolley, however you say it. We have like the watermelons, Sour Bright octopuses, Sour Bright llamas, Sour Bright sloths. I mean, literally anything you could want, but I would say that candy is like a great stocking stuffer as well if you just need something to kind of fill the space. At this one, they've got all kinds of like the Haribo stuff, watermelon, frogs. I'm sure they have like the peach rings here too. They're probably just sold out. They've got those mini belts, but one of my pregnancy cravings that is now coming into play is candy. And the one that I have been looking for for so long is the Nerds Ropes. I didn't even want um, that are like, they're like the nerds ropes, but they're in like a little ball. I don't know. I'll show you if I find them. As far as like snacks and stuff go, I couldn't find those nerd rope things, but I'll, show, I'll of course show you if I can find them eventually. But we've got some golden Oreos here, regular double stuffed Oreos. We've got regular Oreos that are not double stuffed. <laughs> um, fudge covered Nutter Butters, Chips Ahoy, um, Cosmic Brownies. We've got like the chocolate covered donuts, um, just these like white frosted cake donuts, crunch donuts. Um, this is, I know like none of these things are healthy at all, but sometimes you just need like a little fun treat. But I remember my mom would like bring us here too, um, before we went swimming or something like that so that we wouldn't buy anything in. Joseph to the back please. So that we wouldn't buy anything in like the, um, machines like the snack machines whatever you call those oh pregnancy brain um because it's way cheaper here so anyways we've got like lemon zingers chocolate zingers all kinds of stuff chocolate cupcakes swiss rolls zebra cakes christmas tree cakes those are derek's favorites They even have like cliff bars if you're looking for something a little more healthy. We've got like special K protein bars in strawberry and chocolate peanut butter. We've got Nature Valley crunchy bars. You get four bars in there. Huge Rice crispy treats. They even have dill pickles down here, which is interesting because I didn't know the Dollar Street Dollar Tree sold pickles, but tons of snacks like cup cups of fruit. You know what I'm talking about, where they put like the fruit and syrup. Mini Nilla cookies, mini Chips Ahoy. 
You've got your shortbread minis. They even have GIFs to go. They have like a Nutella one with crackers, like graham crackers, and then they have a peanut butter one with pretzels. They also have these fruit crisps if you're gluten-free, and it also says peanut free, just freeze-dried fruit, basically. They have apple, strawberry, and banana. They also have pretty big bags of chips considering they're only a dollar. We've got bugles, or as I used to call them, witch hats. Um, the nacho bugles. We've got the TGI Fridays potato skins. Takis, which are kind of almost sold out back there. We've got the crunchy rice rolls, which I've seen something very similar to these at um, Costco. So these are vegan and gluten-free, so definitely a better choice for you if you're shopping here. They've got pork rinds. They have these ranch fries, cheddar fries, kettle cooked barbecue chips, onions, which are basically onion flavored rings is what they say. Sour cream and onion chips, cheddar and sour cream chips. And a whole other wall here of like everything you'd find in the target aisle for snacks. Okay, other healthy options, because I know a lot of you guys eat very similar to the way we eat. Um, they've got these crispy coconut rolls. I've seen these, um, I can't remember where, I wanna say Costco in like a large bag. They also have these Harvest Snaps um, green pea snacks. Those ones are in white cheddar. These ones are in barbecue. And then they just have like the regular lightly salted ones back there. They've got some wasabi peas. We have some freeze-dried mixed fruit, freeze-dried strawberries, freeze-dried apple slices. And they have some carrot veggie chips here along with like craisins and more fruit crisps. They also have nuts too. So these are cashews. They also have some salt and pepper cashews um, and some dry roasted peanuts right back there to it with like the blue cap. As far as the frozen things go, they obviously have like regular vanilla cones, strawberry shortcake bars, vanilla like the ice cream sandwiches. They also have these Sour Patch Kids watermelon ice pops, which sound really good to me right now. Swirl sticks, they are cotton candy flavored. We have Fruit Loops ice pops, the red, white, and blue like firecracker ones. Um, and then these Icies, which I think would be really fun too. Obviously we're in winter, but <laughs> Honestly, we don't care. We eat ice cream year round. They also have the blue raspberry ices. You get four of them in there. They've got different ice cream flavors as well. Butter pecan, French vanilla, mint chocolate chip. And then you have like your crunch um, ice cream little, they're like little chocolate crunches. Butterfinger, vanilla and cookies and cream. They also do sell ice here, so if you're looking to fill your cooler, this might be a great way to go. We've got some frozen meals. Just your basic ones. They have some pot stickers, some meatballs. They even have Texas toast down here. Okay. And actually, right down at the bottom, these baked soft pretzels. I used to eat these so often with my friends in high school. We loved them because they were microwavable. You just can't microwave them for too long or they get really hard to eat. But I believe, I wanted to say they included the cheese, but I know they include the salt. Um, yeah, they're just really good. There's six of them in there for a dollar. And they are in the frozen section. They also have some frozen pizzas back here and Hot Pockets. If you guys frequently use um, paper plates, they've got paper plates back here. We've got plastic straws, little plastic cups. Um, they also have these coffee to go cups. So if you just use these like every once in a while, like maybe you're headed to church or something and you wanna bring your own coffee or even to work, um, they do include the lids, which I love. There's five of them. They also have these cute little Christmas themed baking cups. You get 50 of them. 
I know a lot of you guys have to be cooking for Christmas, even if you're just cooking for your own family, but they have these um, baking tin trays, like the aluminum trays, the ones that you can throw away for a dollar and every which size you could ever think of. Square, rectangle, circular, with lids, without lids. So this would be a great place to come for that, even ones that are big enough to hold a turkey because these can get really expensive at the regular grocery store and you just throw them away afterwards. That's the whole point. So great place to come for that. They have tons of kitchenware here as well, like a bunch of mixing spoons. You've got your cake decoration kits. Um, they even have this foil backsplash wall sticker, which I thought was interesting. I wonder if you guys are like remaking the Ikea kids kitchen or something. I wonder if this would work for a dollar. I feel like I would definitely try. They even have like your muffin tins, your cake trays, bread pans, and these are like actual, like you don't throw them away. They're definitely thinner than like the really well-made ones, but uh, for a dollar, especially if you don't use it super often. They've got the mixing, uh, not mixing, measuring cups, little scoopers. So in case you have like dog food or something like that, we've got um, our chip clips over here as well. And what I love about this section too, like let's say you have a kiddo who loves to play with all of your mixing spoons. If you are making them like a little kit for Christmas or you're getting them a play kitchen, this is a great place to come and grab some of their play kitchen stuff that they can keep over there. They also carry um, some like nicer utensils. Like these guys are by Betty Crocker. They even carry like some kitchen scissors here, pizza cutters, just things you wouldn't think to look, uh, look for here anyways. They carry knives. And then you've got all these guys over here for cooking as well. Like you even have whisks, tongs, your plastic spatulas or your silicone spatulas. Very cool. Oh, these are interesting too. They have these little silicone gloves, which you can use like for things coming out of the oven. And they have your spoon rests. As far as other food goes, they do have like tomato sauce. They've got lasagna noodles, rotini, um, elbows. And this is like a brand that you would find at King Supers or Kroger or anything like that for a dollar. They've got regular spaghetti, thin spaghetti, a bunch of rice and beans. So many different types of canned beans here. You've got Kraft Mac and Cheese. They also have like cream of mushroom soup. They've got like chicken noodle soup. They have your canned veggies. They've got like your instant ramen noodles here as well. Tons of different kinds of them. Someone also asked to see the medication, so I'll just show it to you really quickly. They've got a bunch of cough drops here all different kinds of them even like the on brand ones um we have some advil multi-symptom and cold and flu nasal relief um basically children's benadryl you've got like basically the z quill sinus congestion and pain compares to tylenol sinus severe aspirin more aspirin um acetaminophen We've got cough relief, pain relief, pain relief PM. It says compare these guys to extra strength Tylenol. Tons of mucus relief as well. Aleve, more mucus relief. Tension headache relief, ibuprofen all the way back there. I'll be out in just a minute. They have a sleep aid compared to Unisum, Advil, nasal decongestant, sinus congestion and pain, cold multi-symptom for daytime and nighttime, more of that same stuff. All day pain relief says compared to Aleve. They have Vicks VapoDrops, some wet wipes, daytime cold and flu liquid capsules, um, Tussin, which obviously you would compare that to Robitussin, mucus and, <laughs> mucus and chest congestion, 
and then more cough drops down here. But definitely make sure you're asking your doctor before you use any of this. I have no idea what you need, but it's all here for a dollar. They also have a ton of like hand soap here. They've got body wash, shampoo, conditioner. This is all actually just hand soap right in here. All of these different kinds, they're all a dollar a piece. We also have some hand sanitizer here. They have um, pads, A&D cream, psoriasis cream, diaper rash cream, everything you can think of. They even have a bunch of stuff for little kids like bibs, some plates, diaper disposal bags, and this section actually reeks of baby powder. So I'm assuming they have baby powder as well. Yes, they do. They've got baby soap, baby lotion, baby powder, a bunch of wipes as well down here. I don't see any diapers though, in case you're wondering about that. They do have a bunch of feminine products though, lots of pads and tampons as well which if you're a girl and you have not tried a cup yet, I would 100% suggest trying a cup. They also have a bunch of shave gel for men and women. They also have tons of toys here, so I'm now in the toy aisle. They even have some on-brand stuff like the JoJo Siwa Superstar Charms. I have no idea what you would even use that for. My Little Ponies here. They're super mini though, so just watch out um, for the size if you have kids who like to put things in their mouth. They also have tiny, tiny, tiny Barbies here. That's my hand next to them. They do have regular full-size Barbies, but they're not on brand, but a dollar a piece. They have tons of stuff. Little dollhouse set with furniture, comes with a doll as well. A sports doll that kind of goes along with the same dollhouse theme. They've got a jewelry set up here, two of them. They also have some tea sets and some kitchen play sets, which again would be great if you're gifting a toy kitchen to your kiddos this year. We've got a ton of little headbands and dress up things. So we have a ladybug, a little bee, a deer, a unicorn. Um, I would say like trolls, but it's just flowers. And then more of like the dress up skirts and things like that, that match the headbands. Tons of little art projects here as well. I'm really looking for these window. I'm really looking for these, really looking for these window clings here um, that are super easy to go on your window. One of our friends had them at her house and Logan loved them and I have yet to find them. So that is what I'm on the hunt for, but they do have this feather foam I have no idea what it does, but it says, watch it come alive. So it's basically like moon sand, kind of. Lots of little dough things to do. A magic show game comes with 10 pieces. I'm sure there's some kiddos out there who would love that. You've even got spin art. Does anybody else rem remember doing spin art when they were younger? I loved that stuff. Or this, the super blast art where you would blow out, um, the like ink or it's kind of like powder but that would be fun too if you're a crafty mama then you might like this as well they've got little chalkboard tags here chalkboard tags clothes pins more chalkboard tags just in a ton of different shapes some little laser tape an embossing stylus I don't know I would just check here um if you are looking for anything crafty they have like a little, like I'd say a little over a half of an aisle dedicated to all this stuff. Finger protectors, magnetic buttons, double-sided tape, metallic markers, craft clamps. They even have like little wooden clothespins, some buttons. You've got your googly eyes here. So if you also have kiddos who love to do crafts or make bracelets, this would be a great place to come. They've got like the alphabet beads. They have little sets like this, but then they also just have basic beads in their little packages for a dollar a piece. Like, I just can't get over it. You can't beat it. They also have some sequins here as well in different little color packs. If your kiddo loves books like Logan does, I didn't even know that they had books here, but they have tons of little books here. Ones that are interactive as well. They even have like some on-brand ones like Sesame Street. Mm -hmm. 
They have Frozen 2, Toy Story. That's actually really cool. I had no idea that they had books here, but right below there, they also have a ton of coloring books. It stretches all the way down there. And then you have some writing books as well. I'll show you those like crosswords, search words, things like that. And I'm sure if you even looked in here, you could probably find some Sudoku right back there. I was looking for the organization section because y'all know I love to organize and this is it. <laughs> this is all they have. Um, so I'm going to show it to you guys really quickly, but they've got this little organizer with a lid, which they have like little paper clips and rubber bands in there with tacks. You've got one that you could organize your nail polish with, although I'm not really sure what size nail polish would fit in there other than like mini because they're really small. Um, they've got this little organizer right here that's open with the lid. They just have like some different sizes and shapes, but then they also have these over the door hooks, which would definitely work for a few things. But honestly, I think maybe it would be better if you went online because I've heard the dollar store has better organizational stuff online. But as for here, nothing that really stands out. Okay, my sad final part time. I really did not find anything that was like absolutely amazing that I had to have, but I'm grabbing these two things some watermelon sour bright crawlers and this little cute um card that uh logan can send to his grandparents so that's what we're getting obviously it'll be two dollars <laughs>